first today at noon, three days until Christmas and the rush to know your COVID status is on. New Orleans city leaders gave away free at home COVID tests and get this. We're told they ran out in a little more than an hour. That really shows you the demand is here. It's booming and city leaders now plan to give away more so they can meet that demand. WDSU Sherman DeSalle joins us live this afternoon. Sherman, you asked city leaders exactly how many tests they gave away in New Orleans. What did they tell you? Yeah, good afternoon, Christina. About 1,600 of these kits were passed out amongst four fire stations in the city in a little less than an hour and a half. Take a look. I'm right here off a of magazine right across from French Truck. So we've been seeing a lot of people. Stefan and I have been seeing a lot of people drive up, walk up, and they are disappointed. At least the look on their faces reflects that. When they see this sign right here, it says, sorry, we are out of COVID test. This happened very quickly. A lot of people trying to get that status known before Christmas. I stopped by one of the fire stations to get one myself. All you're required to do is write down your zip code. You walk away with the test. It takes 15 minutes to do. And we are being told that a lot of people can't find them in the drugstores. Most of the shelves are empty. I stopped by Walgreens earlier. They said they sold out two days ago. Uh, because these tests are 27 bucks. A lot of people are looking forward to getting the test, not just before the holidays, but because this is a free opportunity. So uh, we also heard from the city that they are planning on opening some additional sites through the health department and no SEP. We're going to be waiting for that information soon. But coming up at four, we're going to hear from a couple of people who stopped by here and talking about why they wanted to get this test so fast. Also, we're going to hear from a local epidemiologist talk about the efficacy of this particular test that people are getting their hands on or trying to at least. So again, uh, all these sites, they are scheduled to be back up tomorrow at 8 a.m. until 4 p.m. or until supplies last. My suggestion, get up early because people are not joking around with trying to get their hands on these. We're over here on magazine in front of the fire station. Back to you. All right, Sherman, thank you. In Jefferson Parish, their percent positivity rate is 11% and the Omicron variant is spreading. That's why a lot of you want to know your COVID status, especially before Christmas. Well, today will be the last day to go ahead and get that done at two testing sites. COVID testing at Johnny Bright Playground and the Alario Center will close today at 4 p.m. for the holidays and then they'll reopen on Monday, the 27th.